Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com here. We are doing actually break number two of 2017 Upper Deck Marvel Guardians of the Galaxy. If you look on the spreadsheet right here, at the very top of your screen, it says number two. Big thanks to these folks in the second break here. So we'll randomize names, we'll randomize packs. But first of all, we're gonna generate some numbers. That was that three is from the last break. We're gonna generate two more numbers here from the case that we opened up. Obviously, if we haven't hit a number that has already been opened, we'll just generate again. Box two. We still have box two. There's box two. Box three. We already did three. That was the last break. Three is no longer available. Box four. That's available. There it is. Box four. And uh, break number three actually has filled up. So we will be doing another two boxes uh, right after this in a separate video. So now that we've got this, let's number the packs. Oh, and these box toppers, as you saw in the previous video, as well as the item description, we will be randomizing them to one person in the break. So we'll save these. And I guess there's a one per case, uh, five by seven sketch card. So these box hoppers could be uh, an original sketch card. So that is pretty cool. All right, now we will number the packs. I'll shuffle these a little bit. I don't know if it really makes a difference, but I'll add a little extra element of randomness to it. So there's number one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Then we'll randomize your names and randomize the packs as if they were like uh, as if they were like teams and we'll see what each person gets good luck everybody five and a three eight times for each list one two three four five six seven and eighth and final time brian evans on the pole gabe with the last spot mojo has the last spot all right, and then eight times for the packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. After eight times, pack 19 on top, pack 17 on the bottom. All right, there we go. And once again, we'll obviously be doing these in alphabetical order. Brian, 19, Andrew, 8, Greg, 10, Arthur, 18, uh, Joe Johns, 3, John Oakray, 7, Teddy with 6, John Oakray, 14, Brian with 15, Gabe, you got 20, Barros with, tw uh, with 12, that is Joe Johns, 4, Kike Hernandez, 1, David Barros, 5, Joe Johns, 16, Arthur with 6, Arthur with 9, David, I can't read, <laughs> David Barros with 13, John Oakray, 11, David Barros with 2, and Gabriel, you have 17. All right, so let's alphabetize these by your name. We're not gonna bother with trades. Nobody really trades in these things. I mean, if you wanna make a trade, you, got, you, got, you can yell it out right now, but as soon as I start opening packs, trade window is closed. All right. Here we go. Andrew with just one pack, pack eight. Good luck. 
Eight is over here. Uh, looks like some sort of relic card. It's Galactic Garb Rocket. Nice. It's pretty cool. There you go. Just adjusting the focus a little bit. All right, Andrew, right out of the gate. Strong. All right, Arthur, you are up next. You have packs 18 and 9. There's 18. And right up here is 9. Good luck, Arthur. You have a relic, too. And it's a dual relic. Galactic Garb, Star-Lord, and Ego. Nice. All right, Brian, you're up next. Uh, 19, and five, uh, 19 and 15 for you. There's 19, and there's 15. Family Oddballs, Fast Friends. Brotherhood. And that's it. A couple nice foil inserts there. Brian, thank you. Dave Barrows, 12, 5, 13, 2. Twelve, five, thirteen, and two. Twelve, five, thirteen, and two. Twelve, five, thirteen, two. Great. Good luck, Dave. Looks like a relic. deck packaging <laughs> all right so let's see what that relic is on the bottom so those blue foils those the, what we have to look those up at some point there's different colored foil right there, which may indicate how short printed it is. And there's Galactic Garb Nebula. Nice, there you go, Dave Barrows. Now this makes me really want to see the second one. I haven't seen it yet. I gotta go and see it. All right, Kike, you've got pack one, first one. Oh, and a relic in here too. All it takes is one. Bam, triple relic, Galactic Garb, Star-Lord, Gamora, and Drax. Apparently these are actually from the, uh, the production of the movie, so that's pretty neat. It's a nice triple relic. All right, and Gabe, you have two. 20 and 17. 20 and 17. Good luck, man. 
see what we got. Didn't see a relic. Autograph, maybe? No, some blue foil right there. Nope, afraid not. There's. I mean, this guy, though. All right. There you go, Gabe. Uh, after Gabe, Greg, you are up next. Greg with just one pack, pack 10. That is over here. And a sketch card, nice. Look at that. Drawn by Bianca. Nice, that is pretty cool. That is awesome. Nice. Uh, Greg, I want to say that that's a, that's gotta be a, yeah, it's a one of, it's a unique sketch card. I don't know how many of this she did, but this particular one is unique, original one of one. Greg, all aboard the big hit express. Whoop, whoop. That's pretty strong right there. All it takes is one, ladies and gentlemen, all it takes is one. All right, John Okre, you have the next three packs, 7, 14, and 11. 7, 14, and 11. Joe Johns, you have 3, 14, and 6. 3, 14. No, 3, 4. I can't read. And 16. I was like, I don't see those numbers there. Teddy, you have 6. I'm losing my mind for a second. John, yours first. 7, 14, 11. And remember, everybody in this break still has a shot at those two uh, box hoppers. And one per case, I think, there's a, there's a sketch 5x7. So even if you're like, ah, oh, Joe, I didn't get anything in this break. Well, you might. Hold out for that randomizer. And an autograph, Nebula Auto. Nice, Karen Gillen's autograph. There we go, an autograph for John Oakray. There you go, John, thanks for getting in. Yeah, Paul T says one wood sketch or auto per box. So we got a sketch and an auto. So we're, I think we're, we're above average at this at the moment for these two boxes. Or no, we did we do two box breaks. That's right. So we got a sketch and an auto. Three, four, and sixteen over here. I forget how many relics we pulled, but we'll see. We might be able to see more of those. Maybe another Especial card. That's it, Joe Johns. So I've shot those box toppers. All right, last but not least, Teddy. No wood here, TJ, but I know, I like seeing them too. That's pretty cool. Red foil on these. Oh, that is numbered. All right, there you go. Nine out of 49 on that one. 
And that's it. So there you go, Teddy. Nice. Now, let's see who's going to get... The, uh, the box topper. So that's a completely separate randomizer. So let's go back to random.org. And let's see who gets it. Good luck, everybody. Let's get some new dice. Let's get everybody's names from Andrew down to Teddy. And let's randomize that list four times. Three and a one. One, two, three, and fourth and final time Kike Hernandez Gabriel I think your brother's taking all of your hits man all right nice one Enrique here you go you got the wood from the first break and now you got you have a couple oversized sketch cards Let's see what we have Nice, nice seal. Nice Guardians of the Galaxy seal right there. Not a sketch card, but still pretty cool. Apparently, these are one per case, allegedly. And another one right there. It's, it's Star Lord's mask, I think. There you go. Cool sketch cards, though. I would, you know what I would do? I would frame these, you know what I mean? Like I would I would try to chase the one I like and have them framed up. I think they would look pretty cool. Maybe try to find, like, go to some convention or something, have the artist or something like that, autograph it. Anyhow, folks, another two boxes of Marvel, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 coming up from jazbeeshobbyland.com. This was uh, break number two. Next one will be break number three. Check it out. This is Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. We'll see you next time. Bye.